To those of us who don't make them, the idea of crafting a really excellent video game seems like a kind of magic. And that's before we consider those tiny extra inclusions that have us asking, how did they even think to do that? Any of the games on this list would have been fantastic even without the very minor inclusions we're highlighting, but it's the attention to detail represented by these entries which elevate them to the next level. Would we have enjoyed a great game any less if the developers didn't dilate the protagonist's pupils in certain lighting, or give us a different swimming animation? Probably not, but it's cool that they did it anyway. I'm Jess from What Culture, and here are 10 pointless details in recent video games that'll blow your mind. Number 10. You can press ZL for an alternate swimming animation. The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Just because a detail is pointless doesn't mean it isn't really cool once you notice it, and this is a perfect example of that. In The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, you might notice that while you can swim just fine without doing so, pressing ZL will give you an alternate swimming animation. The especially cool thing about this animation is that it's a direct reference to The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. You know that weird little side swim that Link did on his first 3D outing on the N64? Yeah, it's that. You might also recognize this animation from Twilight Princess. Honestly, I could fill this list with cool little details that enrich the world and showcase the complexity of the mechanics in Breath of the Wild, but we better highlight some other games too. Although being able to shade yourself by holding a big weapon over your head is cool, and so is using sunshrooms and spicy peppers as updrafts. All right, I'm done. Number nine, machine detail and hyper-specific remarks. Horizon Forbidden West. Horizon Forbidden West and 2017's Horizon Zero Dawn for that matter is full of lovely little details that, in the scheme of the game, may seem a little pointless. I mean, there's an argument to be made that the Horizon games would be just as good if Aloy didn't have stunningly animated hair, but it's cool to see these features in action. One of these details is related to the design of the game's impressive machines. While the variations and specifics of how to engage with each one are interesting at a basic level, what's really cool is noting how each machine is made up of an incredible number of individual parts. The graphical detail in the solar panels on a sunwing, or the areas of rust and scratches on a rollerback, for instance, are pretty mind-boggling. As is the way each machine breaks down in a fight, and here's where it gets even cooler, Aloy has extremely specific lines related to which parts of a machine are broken off. For example, upon seeing a fanghorn lose its horns, she'll say something like, what's a fanghorn without horns? If all of that isn't cool enough, if you look closely, you'll also see that all machines have a logo of the cauldron at which they were manufactured. Number eight, horses' eyes reflect everything, Assassin's Creed Origins. You'll notice a distinct lack of that Red Dead Redemption 2 tidbit about horse balls shrinking in the cold on this list, and while that's a very real thing in the game, we've decided to go for a horse-related entry that's a little more flattering. Plenty of collective minds were blown when people were playing 2017's Assassin's Creed Origins, and it was noticed that horses' and camels' eyes reflect the game world around them. If you happen to sidle right up to your horse and take a good look, you can see the living game world of Egypt is mirrored in its eyes, which is pretty darn impressive for something that arguably doesn't improve the game, and which would pass most players by. Curiously, this feature wasn't replicated for the sequel, Assassin's Creed Odyssey, but it's an addition that makes Origins all the more impressive and endears players to the developers for putting extra attention into making the game rich and immersive. Number 7. Spidey's voice track changes based on his exertion. Marvel's Spider-Man. Insomniac Games' Spider-Man achieved so much. It cemented that a Spider-Man video game could be excellent in the modern gaming age, it created an absolutely addictive playground to mess around in, and there was a really strong story pinning everything down. Insomniac didn't rest on their laurels with just those incredible mechanics, though. They also created something really special with their voice work. Spider-Man voice actor Yuri Lowenthal actually recorded two different voice tracks for all of his lines in the game, and the game switches between them based on whether or not he's exerting himself at the time. For the uninitiated, you'll have a lot of your conversations on the go, so there's a good chance you might be swinging around town in which it wouldn't make a ton of sense for Spidey to sound like he's casually sipping a latte. It might seem pointless, but being able to hear the huffing in Yuri's voice when Spidey is on a call does so much for the game's immersion and your investment in the character. It's incredibly impressive. Number 6. Singing in the Car – Far Cry 6 This one may seem silly and pointless, but hey, that's the name of the list and I personally really enjoyed this one when I encountered it in Far Cry 6. You play Danny in the 2021 action-adventure and you'll spend your time exploring Yara and trying to kick off a revolution. 
Naturally, all that exploring requires you to drive around from place to place pretty often, and as you'd have come to expect with any modern game in which you drive a car, there's a radio. That isn't the interesting bit though. The interesting bit is that regardless of whether you play male or female Danny, there are certain songs your protagonist will sing along to in the car. It's such a minor thing that doesn't impact the gameplay in any significant way, but it's so cool to discover. It's also such a simple addition, it's a wonder it hasn't been done in more games. I mean, if you're a studio and you're gonna pay to have Live and La Vida Loca in your game, you may as well have your protagonist jamming along to it. I sure as hell would be. The result is a more relatable Danny and a fun moment in a game that's all about the bombastic, so it's a win-win. Number five, Cassie's action figure, Mortal Kombat 11. When you think about pointless details that blow your mind and how they might relate to Mortal Kombat 11, you're probably thinking about fatalities and literal mind-blowing. Those don't make this list as the brutalities and fatalities are so intrinsic to the heart and soul of Mortal Kombat that you couldn't possibly call them pointless. A relatively pointless but super cool detail can be seen during one of Johnny Cage's win poses. In this win pose, he pulls out an action figure of himself and shows you how tough and cool it is. In an adorable blink and you'll miss it moment, you can see that on the bottom of the shoe, the word Cassie is written. The handwriting and the style is very similar to how Andy is written on the bottom of Woody's shoe in Toy Story, so that's kind of a cool callback. Similarly, this suggests that the action figure isn't Johnny's at all, but rather it belongs or belonged to his daughter Cassie Cage, who's also a fighter in Mortal Kombat 11. It's weird to include such a charming detail in an otherwise no-holds-barred hardcore violent game, but that's attentive devs for you. Number four, mopping traces. Control. Much like many of the other games on this list, Control has so much going on under the hood, and the vast majority of those details are anything but pointless. This one is, but that doesn't stop it from being incredibly cool. If you thought a name on the bottom of an action figure's shoe was a little small potatoes for any developer to spend time envisioning and implementing, may I introduce you to the debris of mopping. Yes, one of my most hated household chores is alive and well in control. And look, we'd better point out that the janitor arty is a pretty big deal in control, so we can see why they'd put a little extra love into his work but it's not something you see often. Despite being a rarity, and no, there is no normal way to say this, the mopping swirls are genuinely gorgeous and the attention to detail is stunning. The environments in this 2019 action game are just mind-blowing, and perhaps it's the fact that the designers put effort in everything, down to the literal water residue on the ground, that it resonated with gamers the way it did. Number three, extreme gun detail, Escape from Tarkov. This one is so impressive, I feel a little bad about calling it pointless, but given that the game would be just as popular if they didn't do this, I think it qualifies. Credit to one of our viewers, Guillaume Passin, for reminding us about this one in the comments of our video from last year highlighting games that have an insane level of detail. 2017 multiplayer FPS Escape from Tarkov may be made in Unity by an indie studio, but Battlestate Games proved you don't have to have all the resources in the world to pour love and attention into your game. In this case, the studio went to the effort of 3D scanning gear and weapons down to the innards of each of the guns. This includes implementing an enormous amount of animations that include checking the chamber and bullets being ejected. The attention to detail extends to every combination of attachments and ammo, as well as the weight of different weapons. The game would have been a perfectly good shooter without it, but the goodwill that it earns from players by showing that they're willing to go out and implement this kind of thing stands for a lot. Number two, pupils that respond to the light, Red Dead Redemption 2. Red Dead Redemption 2 is another game that could easily fill this list on its own, but we've gone with something so minor there's a good chance you totally missed it. It may seem silly and unnecessary, but if you did happen to catch it or you're just learning about it now, I bet you'll find it at least a little mind-blowing. Depending on the lighting that's around your protagonist, Arthur Morgan, you'll notice that his pupils dilate differently. You know, just like in real life. In darker environments, you can see his pupils are slightly larger, and in broad daylight, they appear much smaller. Red Dead Redemption 2 has plenty of other tiny things like this, including the eyes of alligators glowing at nighttime, and guns in poor condition producing different sounds than well-maintained guns. Like I said, when it comes to Red Dead Redemption 2, we could easily fill out this top 10 list and then some, but we'll move on. Number 1. Footprints in the Sand, Elden Ring if you're wondering why I would choose footprints out of all the incredible little details in Elden Ring, you have to remember we're looking for pointless stuff here. While many of Elden Ring's little intricacies are important combat considerations or world-building easter eggs, 
This one's just a little cool thing uncovered by Twitch streamer Lance McDonald. This one in particular concerns what happens if you walk along the sandy beach without shoes on. This is another example of a detail that could easily have been omitted without hurting the quality of the game, but it's still a super cool feature for them to have implemented. If you walk barefoot along the beach, you'll actually leave footprints complete with little dots where your toes hit the sand. Comparatively, wearing shoes will leave regular shoe prints. So there's a fun thing you can try out between inevitable deaths. That's the end of our list, but if you can think of any other pointless details in recent video games that blew your mind, be sure to let me know what they are down in that comment section. As always, I've been Jess from What Culture. Thank you so very much for hanging out with me. If you like, you can stop by my Twitter account and say hi, where I'm at Jess McDonnell. But make sure you stay tuned to us here for plenty more gaming goodness.